So we came into the fight basically when the landmen came knocking on the door and wanted my folks to give up an easement for the pipeline, three acres of woodland that had been set aside for conservation. And we decided not to do that. And so for the past two and a half years, we've been involved with litigation, fighting the process of eminent domain for private gain. And we fought the permitting for the project because we believe that there's no legal way to issue permits for these projects. We're still being told that we don't get to say no. We've been watching construction for the Mariner East Pipeline happen since February, and there have been more than 100 known cases of water contamination from runoff, from horizontal directional drilling. They're spilling this drilling slurry all over the state. They have contaminated private well water. They've contaminated trout streams and other waterways, which makes them criminals. And we're watching this happen and still being told that we don't get to tell them no, that we either have to let them do that to our home, to our streams, to our drinking water, or we are going to jail. Now what it looks like, we're going to go to jail and they're going to destroy our water anyway. We're not just going to stand by and allow them to do it. We are going to put up a fight.